Good evening, everybody. This is Corner Fox One. You're welcome to Fox Live. No, I'm just kidding, guys. We're not actually a newscast. I mean, we're not some corporate government, you know, detailed thing. Whatever. But anyway, uh, to the topic. Um, okay, now, first off, for you guys think, uh, this is some religious channel. No, actually, this is not a religious channel. I'm actually talking about uh, Jehovah Witnesses I have encountered yesterday. Um... Okay, like here's the deal. I went to the store, and actually, no. Let me let me uh, stop myself right there before I begin further. I have no problem with people with religious aspects. They have the right to a title of their opinion and beliefs. That's that's all you. That's fine. You know, believe what you want to believe, whatever. But uh, I encountered some Jehovah Witnesses yesterday, and I went to the store. I was walking to the store. It was like maybe about a block away at Highways Gas, and. Uh, these two guys came up. So they were wearing a uh, black black tie, white shirt, and black pants, and some black fancy dress shoes. And they were carrying a Bible. And they asked me, "Well, would you like to hear about our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ?" And I'm just looking at them like, you "No, know, if I wanted to, you know, go to, uh, you know, if I wanted to, you know, express religion, I would go to go to a church or whatever." Well, me particularly, I am not religious myself. I don't see the need to be religious, uh, to be a good person. None of that stuff. I mean, it's just, to me, it's just complete bullshit. Um, no offense, obviously. Uh, not everybody, you know, that is religious is bad people, but these guys were particularly, you know, they just, they just kept following me, and I was like, well, we would like to... Since you don't believe in God, we would like to teach you about God. I'm like, I already know about God. My family's Catholic. You know, it's, it's, you know, this is something I don't really want to get into anymore. I mean, I, I got out of it when I was like, God, I forgot what, it was like 13? I was 13 years old. And these guys were like, well, if you, you know, if you don't believe in God, you know, you're, you're going to be going to hell. I'm like, dude, I'm thinking to myself, dude, hold on a second. What if we're already in hell? I mean, to me, right now, this is hell. You know, we're, we're, we're trying to survive as hell. I mean, you can't just turn around and tell someone, you don't believe in God, well, you're going to hell. Well, you know something, I mean, that's what you think, fine, but you don't, you don't try to shove things down my throat because of what you believe in. This is not something, you know, anyone should do. I mean, if you wanna, if you, if you wanna use your religion to spread peace, but you don't want to force someone's down throat. Like, let's say if you want to do some, like, good gestures, like, you know, help the poor, you know, or help a friend out, whatever. You know, that, that's that's a good deed. You're, you're just trying to be a person. This has nothing to do with religion, actually. But, you know, the, these guys, they're like, well, you're, you're going to go to hell if you don't believe in God. Well, you want to know something? What makes you so sure God exists? You know, he's like, well, we'll look around us. You know, it's like, okay, well, this also scientist that also says that, you know, other, you know, the <laughs> there is absolutely no proof that God even exists. Well, let me explain to you something. I believe Jesus had exist. I believe he was a philosopher, not a son of God. I mean, things got, things get kind of, you know, weird in the Bible. I mean, later on, if you actually look deeper into a fucking Bible, it literally say, hey, you know, well, now we're going to talk about aliens. You know, it, it just it just goes further on, and you know, it also specifies, you know, women should be raped. You know, it's okay for women to be raped and shit like that. I'm like, you know, that's that's not something I really want to discuss. I mean, the, this is not something I really want to follow. I mean, I follow my own path. I mean, you shouldn't just come to me and say, hey, you know, you, you better follow us. Well, why should I follow you? You haven't given me a good reason why I should follow you. On top of that, you know, you're coming to me, insulting me, saying that if I don't believe in God, well... You know, you're going to hell. Well, if I'm going to hell, well, you know what? I guess I'm in luck because I'm already in it. So, you know, Jehovah Witnesses, I'm not saying all you guys are bad. I mean, I've met a couple of you guys that, you know, obviously came to me and says, would you like to hear our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ? And I said, no, you guys left me alone. That's fine. But, you know, when these particular people come to me and, you know, says, I'm going to go to hell because uh, I don't believe in God, I'm a piece of crap, a worthless piece of human being, you know, you guys can go fuck off. Honestly, just go fuck off. So... You know, if you guys encounter these, if you guys ever encounter Jehovah Witnesses, you know, if they don't leave you alone, you know, just tell them to basically go fuck off. I mean, like I said, not all Jehovah Witnesses are bad. They're good people. Some of them are good people. Some of them are just like, well, you know, you need to, 
you need to, you know, work on your life better. You just don't even bother. But, uh, anyway, you know, I, I personally believe if you're a good person, you don't need to follow a religion. You don't need to follow, you know, Muhammad. You don't need to follow Christ, anything like that. You don't, you don't need to follow that. If you want to be you, be you. Okay, don't let someone turn around and try to force teach religion down your throat when you're not interested. Obviously, there are people out there that needs guidance. Well, you know something? How about talking to a friend? You don't always need to go to church to pray. You don't need to go to, you, you know, if, let's say if you're religion, you don't need to go to church to pray. You can just stay in your house, sit down, and pray. So, anyway. Uh... I'm just sorry, it's just still a little pissed off from yesterday. Anyway, um, <clears throat> you guys have a nice day. Thank you for watching. And uh, I hope to see you guys around. If you guys uh, like the video that I posted up, please hit the like button and hit the subscribe button. And uh, you guys have a nice day. And thank you very much.